I wanted to show you how to manage accounts in our software Samurai Seller. Next to the Samurai Seller logo, you can see this flag symbolizing the given marketplace that you are looking at. Every single tool, analytics, all the data information is going to be giving you the information under that marketplace, under that brand, under that business entity, so to speak. So once again, you have the flag, then you have your business name and you have this icon here for the drop down menu. And this is what we are going to explore a little bit. When you click on it, you will see that you can have an email address and then all the different marketplaces, businesses, business entities listed under that with your Amazon profile or the name that you gave to that given Amazon profile. And then you can have an other email address. None of these need to match necessarily the main email address over here. That is your Samurai Seller login email. These email addresses over here under your accounts are basically the email addresses that are associated with your Seller Central account, specifically in the case of Samurai Seller with your advertising data. So once again, you could have 10, 15, as many emails as you want listed for as many marketplaces as applicable. Now, if I right now I'm on this first marketplace in terms of Samurai Seller, but let's say I wanted to look at the UK marketplace as an ex example, I would need to click on that. You will see the flag and uh, all the data change up here. And now analytics or any of these tools with optimizer, quick negative measure, etc., are going to apply to this marketplace specifically. For example, when you create campaigns, if I click on create campaigns and I create campaigns, they will be created on my UK account. Let's go back. Now, if I didn't want to create them on the UK account, I need to make sure that I go, for example, to my US account and then click create campaigns. Then I'm going to be creating them on that US account. On this drop down menu, you also have manage accounts. This is going to give you a little different screen. Let's click on it. Here you have name associated with those email addresses that you've seen before, the profiles listed, and you also have these little numbers here when you hover over. And this is true anywhere in the software. When you see these blue numbers, you hover over, you are going to see the remaining information that can be found there. In this case, all these different marketplaces, green ones are the ones that are turned on, red ones are the ones that are turned off. Here you can do the same. You see this email is for the EU region. And as I pointed out there, only one account, the UK marketplace was active. All the other ones are red and that's the only one that is green. Another way to get to the same information is by clicking this link manage profiles and you can see here all of these are deactivated or turned off and only this one here that is associated with UK that's the one turned on here you can manage connect them um, activate them deactivate them as needed Amazon logins you can click on that and go back to the original page where you have your names associated names email addresses amazon profile and now let's go back on into our us account i want to show you something else here and that would be these change mws token or connect mws buttons now if they are not showing up on a certain account a marketplace or Amazon profile, for example, here on the Mexican one is not showing up. That is because there is nothing that button would currently do in the software where they do show up. And currently that will be either the US or the Canadian marketplace. So where they do show up, you can click on them and you can 
go through the setup steps and add this additional connection between your Samurai Seller account and your Seller Central or Campaign Manager account. Now, what that does is it gives access to Samurai Seller for additional data and in turn, Samurai Seller can activate additional features on your account. For example, on this account where it's already connected, we can change it if we need to, or on this account where it's not connected yet, we could connect it if we wanted to. But back to this one where it's already connected, currently the Profit and Ads dashboard beta uses that connection. This will not work for you unless the MWS connection was already created for that marketplace. In the future, you will have that for every marketplace that we can create it for, but since this dashboard is still in beta, we only keep it for the US and Canadian marketplaces and it will grow as we progress. What else do we need to cover here? Probably this button here, add login, and this will be the last thing for this video. When you click on it, it would pull you into the Amazon login page. This is amazon.com, but don't worry about it. Even if it would be a Japanese account or something like that, you can just enter your email address, your password, basically your login information for that account and it will find the right account and hook it up to Samurai Seller. I already have it pre-filled, pre-populated, but in your case, obviously, you would put in whatever is applicable for you. And that will do it for this video.